Yo, what's up guys? You got Pokegame here with the Toxtricity Showcase. We're going to be showing off Toxtricity and Pokemon Sword and Shield. I built this really fun looking team, but it's honestly 6-0 by Halucha. So hopefully my uh, my luck at avoiding 6-0 matchups comes into play right here. But Toxtricity is such a cool Pokemon. If you guys want to see me uh, talk about the moveset I'll be using, I actually have a moveset video guide. Feel free to check that out. But let's go over the team. We have Choice Specs, Toxtricity with the Punk Rock. Boom Burst, Overdrive, Sludge Wave, and Volt Switch. Apologies if I sound tired. It's because I am. <laughs> I can't, I'm not going to lie to y'all. Uh, I've been doing streams from 3 a.m. to 11 a.m. at A Drive's house for the 252 uh, marathon he's doing. And we just completed a whole week of streaming straight uh, a few hours ago. And I just got off my shift and I'm ready to record. And I got a whole lot to record today, but I'm excited. I'm, I'm pretty excited. I got. Choice Specs with the Volts, which got some little Volt turn with Darmanitan Galarian going off over here. I have the anti Excadrill lead Defog Conkelder with Mach Punch, Drain Punch, and Earthquake for Age Slash and Toxic Specs. G Max Charizard. I, this is supposed to be a Togekiss, and it was a lot better as a Togekiss, but Charizard just sounds fun, and I want to have some fun. Uh, we have a Grim Snarl as well, uh, which one of the sets that I might end up using, though I probably will edit EVs and stuff when I actually uh, talk about this mod. In itself and last but not least we have a stealth rocking size themselves so to help us out versus rain but yeah that's a squad for today let's look for a battle by the way guys it's been 200 uh I, this is a like i said i'm at i'm at twitch.tv such a drive basically every night um from 3 a.m to 11 a.m it's been so much fun and so many people have been learning pokemon and i think it's so cool uh we've gained subscribers and and obviously you know i want to grow and i want to grow competitive uh the competitive scene as well but another thing about that is there's actually limited edition, like, Drop a Draco merch going on during that time. I didn't mention it on my channel uh, because it was kind of just for the event. But I realized it might be a little bit <laughs> selfish to not mention it to the people that always pick up Drop a Draco and have been supporting me so uh, so far. But it's kind of a callback to the original Drop a Draco where we still have a almost a Mons design right here. Um, but yeah, uh, if you guys want to pick it up, I'll link that down below. But that ends on Monday. <laughs> my bad, guys. Anyway... Wow, uh, is this supposed to be stall? I don't know. Hey, stall with no electric resist though? They call me Toxtricity. <laughs> yeah, bye. Ooh, and Char's are looking kind of nice here too. How do you beat bulk up Grinsnarl? Is it your own Grinsnarl? Hmm. Toxtricity actually walls Toxtricity because of its punk rock ability as well, so that's really interesting. Uh, I think I'm just going to start clicking some buttons right now with my boy, Young. Toxtricity. Uh, he ends up leading off with his own. Um, as I mentioned, this mod kind of walls itself, so it's really interesting to think what he'll be clicking here. Uh, I'm going to click Boom Burst. If he wants to go out to Corsola immediately, I guess he can go Umbreon too. Uh, Corsola just means I get up rocks on my sides and so I'm not worried. Yep, he goes Corsola, which is obviously immune. immune. That's pretty, that's that's fine, honestly. Um, my own size and so I can just come out and click rocks here. I'm not worried about Corviknight either. If I if I need to defog later, I will. But uh, we'll get up rocks as they go out into Hatterene. I completely forgot about the magic bounce. No. So you go for like a Dazzling Gleam here, I'd imagine. Hmm. Yeah, I go for Dazzling Gleam considering I have the Grimstone on the back. As they throw off a Psychic, which is not what I wanted to see, man. All right, it's time. This is, this is Gigantamax, so it should do some decent damage. And it should it should wrap it around it. Why is this not working the way it's supposed to work? That's not the way it's supposed to work. I went for this, by the way, just to get the speed, because I'll still be able to knock him out. But that's like I said, that's not the way it's supposed to work. Why am I not using my... Is it a specific fire move I gotta use? Is it Flamethrower, not Fire Blast? Oh, that makes me sad. That's fair. Let me, let me see real quick. Sword and shield. Hmm. It it it's literally a fire. It's a so it's supposed to be a fire spin. That's so sad. So that's not working the way it's supposed to work, unfortunately. Um, my opponent really hates this Pokemon though, so. So you can go for another one as they end up, I think, sacking their Meowstic there. That is really unfortunate, though, that that didn't work the way it was supposed to. And I'm, I'm, I'm truly sad about that. Uh, seriously, because that should have trapped Umbreon. It should have been dead. 
but I can Volt Switch around their entire team. And here I think I'm just going to kind of sack. Uh, one mod that wins really easily is Bulk Up Grinstar. That was so annoying. Make a Dynamax here, but I'm going to go size himself because I can end some turns as they go for Fire Blast. Again, they could Dynamax, but that means they can't do it later. So I'll, I'll click Protect again. Uh, I can end up sacking my Charizard anyway. Uh, but yeah, if they opt to Dynamax, at least I can waste a turn of that. They're going to go for their Solar Beam, though. Their Max Overgrow. It shouldn't kill me through Protect. <laughs> Barely misses out on the KO, but luckily I get a little bit of recovery there. Nice. Sack Charizard here as he goes for the Max Airstream. Hmm. I do think going Grimstar and just going for a Darkest Lariat makes the most sense. I don't think I'll die to one hit exactly. And I need as much damage off as possible on this thing. That's not a lot of damage, obviously, but the turns are going to end right there. And I can go for Sucker Punch to knock him out. I barely missed out of the KO, man. Come on, bro. That's Dreadplay Boosted. That's so sad. That's actually so sad. We'll bring out Conkeldur here. I anticipate him to want to go out into Corsola. Even by default, it doesn't actually do anything, but I'm, I'm going to go for it anyway because I, I need my... Uh, first off, I can't Earthquake. Uh, secondly, uh, because I, I, I have Grass Terrain up, so I can't Earthquake. That's so sad, man. They're broken. Hmm. Beautiful damage. I still think that Toxtricity can do it. Because with Overdrive, it's really strong. And I shouldn't die to a Boom Burst either. Overdrive is super strong, especially because I'm Choice Specs. So I need that Earthquake damage off. Um, go ahead and give me that. Beautiful. Can Overdrive again. I shouldn't die. Exactly, because of my ability. Go ahead and give me that. Ooh, I have a decent shot of winning this. We'll just go out to Darmanitan here. As they protect, yep, and that's going to give me a nice and free U-turn. Nice and free U-turn here. As they go Corviknight, which uh, once again still gives me my Toxtricity. And we just go for the Specs Volt Switch. I don't have to bother predicting. Uh, I keep up momentum by going for Volt Switch. Icicle Crash is still very strong as well. I'm missing out that KO is a little bit annoying. Power trip. Rocks as well. I don't think I have to worry about... Ooh. I don't want to give them the opening for Umbreon, so I'm actually going to bring this thing out. Can you even beat me? I don't think you do any damage to me. All right, let's get some damage off on you then, I guess. I do not want to get burnt. So I'd rather let I'd rather let Sizemto come out and Toxic, because you don't have Heal Bell yet. On Umbreon. Umbreon doesn't exist with Heal Bell at the moment. So Oh that doesn't matter. I got on my rocks now. Perfect. Alright, so I have the Umbreon on a timer. Obviously it can wish protect, but I can kind of just spam scald. Like I said, Heal Bell does not exist. So if I have this thing on a timer, I can just start spamming overdrive. Play doesn't matter. Yeah, I basically got to make it that I can just go for U-turn here. Knock you out. And then make it come down to... Uh, I mean, I guess Curse Body activating, huh? That did so much damage. Didn't get the Curse Body, though. And I'm going to be able to bring out in my Darmanitan. I have to hit Icicle Crash to win. Otherwise, they go for Strength Sap. Hey, your boy was able to do it. Good game. Not bad. No good game back. Yo, Ditto is nasty. I'm so sorry, by the way, about this loading thing. I can't do anything about that. I'm at A-Drive's house, and the, and the Wi-Fi is really bad. But, um, yo, Ditto was nasty, man. It really almost reverse swept me with Charizard. 
But hey, toxicity though, fire. Fire. Let's go and look for another one. I'm gonna try and like pull it away. If that helps. In any way, shape, or form. Okay. Toxicity is not bad at all if I can get rid of Excadrill. And I have an anti lead just for that, which is Conkelder. I'm going to Drain Punch right here. I see no reason not to because I can Drain Punch into uh, the fo uh, defo uh, Defog. I can Drain Punch into Defog. And basically deal with you. Doesn't matter if he earthquakes. I'm still at 100%. We can defog right here. He might go Aegislash, I guess, on the anticipated. Oh, okay, that's fine. I'm able to defog. Shout out to Defog Conkelder. Gets it now. It uses its cement to blow away all the rocks, I, I guess. I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, we get rid of Excadrill, which is amazing because now I can Boom Burst and I can. Uh, well, now I can Volt Switch Spam, excuse me. Which is very important. That's hilarious, yo, facts. I have no idea how we're supposed to beat Gyarados, by the way. <laughs> I have no idea. I made my team pretty weak to everything. Luckily, he goes Toxtricity, which gives me... I mean, he goes Corviknight, which gives me Toxtricity, so that's amazing for me. And I have no reason to not to click Overdrive here. I would click Boom Burst, predicting Hydreigon, but Overdrive is just so strong. It is so strong, I'm going to click it. If he goes I Dragon, I can always go Conkelder. And Boom Burst, I guess, that did so much damage, man, all things considered. And I have Grimmsnarl as well as an answer, but... I think what I'm going to do is go Seism Toad instead of going Grimmsnarl. As he goes for the the U-turn. And this is pretty cool because this Mon is a Mon that he doesn't have a good response to. Exactly. I thought, I didn't think he'd be Choice Locked, uh, which I'm assuming he is. But if I get up rocks, nothing comes in on overdrive. If he goes Gyarados, I can toxic that thing unless he's running taunt, which is kind of not ran, or sub, which I don't think Gyarados can afford to run. So I'm a toxic. Come on, 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 come on. Hey. I'll stealth rock as well. Uh, the reason I'm doing this is because I don't think I'll, unless he's rest talk, I won't lose to it. I think I'm going to try and outplay his Dynamax. Or anything like that. Power Whipping. Yo, Charizard looks nasty here. Maybe I made the wrong play. Toxtricity. Kong Kelder's Mach Punch is still good for Hydreigon, but I have an answer to Hydreigon. I think we just sat Kong. I, I should have actually protected there. Um, I thought he was going to Dynamax the last turn. Unfortunately, did not work out how I wanted, but we still have that Gyarados on that timer. So I'm not like I'm, I'm worried, but I'm not super worried. And Seismito's role is literally to take you on. So let him not, even if he knocks me out here, which he should. Oh, he goes to the wrong move. He should have used the other one. It doesn't matter about him getting speed at all because I have Sucker Punch at the end of the day. And when Dynamax ends, he dies and he has no answers to Grimmsnarl. Whereas I have Fire Blast and Heavy Duty Boots and stuff. Might as well try and go for Double Protect. Just airstreams there to knock me out. <laughs> this one's broken. <laughs> and I could just go right out to Grim Snow. And the cool thing is if he goes Corviknight, I because rocks are up. Because rocks are up, I can literally go out into um Toxtricity and just spam overdrive one more time. I believe anyway. I'm gonna bring out Charizard here just because I'm a little bit worried. Like, I, don't, I doubt he'd bulk up immediately because he doesn't know my my set. Yeah. I'm just gonna fire blast for damage. Ooh, he has dual screens. Okay. That should be okay. I don't know if I'll lose necessarily. Maybe it's a weakness policy. I don't know what move he's running, but I'm going to go Grimmsnarl and start bulking up. 
because he can't taunt. He can't taunt a Brozen Grimmsnarl. I don't know if he's running. Well, if he's running Play Rough, actually going Grimmsnarl is a bad play. <laughs> so I'm just gonna keep Fire Blasting then. I think he's running Darkest Lariat, personally. Or Spirit Beg, yeah. I'm gonna try and waste his uh, because I don't need HP on this mon. Uh, Grimmsnarl should be H slash, I think. I get a really nasty crit as well. We're bringing Toxtricity because I can Volt Switch on Age Slash. I'm basically trying to waste the turns of screens, and I don't want to give Age Slash like a weakness policy or something. He already Dynamax, so I'm good. He's on a balloon, so he is the uh, he more than likely is the Atomize set, but every bit of damage is gonna matter. I do not see a reason to not go Darmanitan because Darmanitan is guaranteed damage. Even if he atomizes, I'm faster. Mm, well, depends. Hey, look at that big... Oh, and I get a nasty burn too. And that that burn is nasty because he had to. He basically had to try and outplay my... Um, he had to outplay Sucker Punches, but... I'll just die here. He might try and sub... It doesn't matter. I bring out Toxtricity and I click Overdrive. That yeah, doesn't matter, my friend. I'm sorry. I bring out Toxtricity and I click that Overdrive. Again, that only mattered if he... Um, that only mattered if he outplayed all my Sucker Punches, which he had to do. Literally every single one. But we're going to click that Sound Move Overdrive. Go ahead and give me that. And that's game. That is the game. They call him Toxtricity. Yo, I'm like barely surviving <laughs> versus these mods. This is like the same team as the last guy, but with webs. Nasty. Okay. Their mana 10 is really good early on. Uh, I can get up rocks as well. They have a ditto. Lovely Pokemon. Uh, bulk up Grimstar wins. Their own Grimstar is very good versus me. But my Toxtricity. If I get rid of you, it's good. Alright, we'll go Darm early. I'm not sure, like, the initial... Res how my initial response should be to a Corsola. <laughs> I feel like it's a little bit overhyped of a Mon, but also solid at the same time. I don't know. Whatever, I'm getting my rocks. I don't care. We'll click Toxic here. Maybe he might Nightshade. Um, could go out to Araquanid here, but if I get the Toxic off, I think I'm I'm really, really, really solid versus you. Yo, how do you beat Charizard? <laughs> Is it you just Charizard me back? Is that your way of beating Charizard? Because it getting Hurricane now is so sick. Anyway, hey, we Fire Blast. I'm not Gigantamax. I'm not Dynamaxing because I'm worried. Uh, or Gigantamaxing, rather. Also, I shouldn't. It should be a Dynamax one, but he doesn't have a fire answer into a hurricane. So basically everything on my opponent's team will die to fire blast into hurricane. Which is what I'm trying to say. Or maybe not. Hmm. Actually, you resist. Yeah, you will die. You'll die. Hit him. Hit him, Charizard. Oh, come on, Charizard. Seriously, man? All right, we'll bring out Toxtricity, and I'm going to click the Boom Burst because it's going to hit incredibly hard. Um, that really sucks. But Boom Burst, look, at, look how strong that move is, man. Go ahead and give me that Pokemon. I love it. I love it. x comes out. You have, like, no reason not to click Earthquake here, but Sizem Sword eats, so... rocks in your face. I don't care. Is that choice ban Excadrill? Why'd you do 22%? That is definitely a choice ban Excadrill. <laughs> Alright, we go Toxtricity. On the strength sap. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, click Boom Burst here. Because if they go Excadrill, I want to see how much damage it's going to do. I don't think they stay in because I can Thunderbolt and they're poisoned. I don't, I don't care if they stayed in either. You know what? Go ahead and do that, buddy. Take a million damage from me. Hmm. Okay. 
I mean, it's annoying, but I, I really didn't think they'd stay in. I'm gonna make sure they don't get any recovery here, so I'm gonna go for protect. So they can't stress at me. Get rid of Corsola as well. Go ahead and give me that. Should I, should I Dynamax on Extra Girl? That way I live the rapid spin and can click uh, a button. Is that even a play? Does that even make much sense to do? I'm worried about the bug and ditto. I'll defog. I'm actually super worried about the ice bug. But we'll defog here. I needed my flame warp so I can kill uh, extra girl. I'm not sure how I beat ice bug, but I'm thinking I just go hard into their manatee and click flare blitz because they don't have a fire resist left beside. Yeah, they don't have fire resist at all. You are a problem though. Okay, I'll sack Seismitoad here. Uh, if they bulk up and try to go for Sucker Punch, I'll go for Toxic here. It depends on how much speed they're running. They just Spirit Break immediately. Uh, I think I'm basically forced to, um, to Dynamax. That way I guarantee live their hit. And do a ton of damage back. Hey, go ahead and give me that. Go ahead and give me that. So I think this Mon might win, to be honest, but I could be wrong. As long as I have this in the back, I don't think I'll lose. Okay, they can't even Dynamax Ditto. That's perfect. Hmm. I think it's going to come down to speed ties. I'm going to waste as many turns as possible, if possible here. Then again, they get defense raises, which is really annoying. It's going to come down to speed tie. That's it. Because I'll, I'll mock punch for damage. Okay, I, I can kill them with Flare Blitz. But yeah, like I said, it's literally going to come down to a Ditto Speed Tire right now. Because in regular form, they're still going to die. I'm a Darmanitan, sorry. Come on, Darm. You can win it. What? Oh, they set up Sand. Good game. Oh my gosh. That is so cool. That is so cool. Okay, so what happened there was, I wasn't even paying attention that it wasn't Mode Breaker the entire time. But... They, <laughs> they uh, decided they set up the sand, which meant them be able, they made them able to sweep me, which is crazy. Wow! So if I click Sucker Punch with my Grim Snarl, which I probably should have, I would have gotten enough, enough damage to maybe the Mock Punch the KO. So I should have clicked Sucker Punch. All right, take the first loss on this account on on this starting ladder. So uh, I just played this guy. Actually, adore Con Calder once again. As a lead Grim Snarl, and I'm I'm so weak to this mon. I truly am, but they're taunt like Spirit Break or whatever, so I can force them to taunt here and try and go for a burn on them. Nice, awesome. I want to get my Flame Orb activated just because I need it, and they're gonna light screen anyway. I'll need it to like mock punch Hydreigon. Thanks, Drill. Sick, and what I can do now is just go Toxtricity. I don't care about their taunt. I'll Boom Burst just on the extra to break its Focus Sash. That did that much through a screen, by the way, which is insane. And we'll go out to Conk Elder because we can just defog immediately. Come on, dude. There you go. I'm an earthquake. Because I could easily mock punch. No! Mock punch would have owned you. Oh my gosh. Oh well. I think what they're thinking they could do now is just go out to Gyarados and maybe beat me down. Do I actually lose the Gyarados if it sets up? I might. Then again, it doesn't have. Okay, they ended up going out to you. You don't beat me. I know your set. I, I know your entire set. You're like. Maybe if you do beat me. I gain toxicity here. Yeah, and I just click my uh, my button. 
I'm a man if I, I click boom burst and I'm doing it. <laughs> Go ahead and give me that. <laughs> Entire Mon fell over. Entire Mon just fell over. Age Slash comes out. I go hard Charizard, man. Hard into Charizard. Uh, I have to make sure I have a game plan for beating Gyarados, which I don't. But I do think I'm in a max player here. Dude, you're going to die. There is no way. You are dead, my friend. I get the sun up, which is pretty cool, I guess. Because I might be able to kill Grimmsnarl. Yeah! I don't think I beat Gyarados, though. <laughs> it's like, Especially because they have leftovers. Alright. Ooh, Overdrive is going to be so nasty in this game. I love it. Oh, and Rocks are going to be key as well. They do have Magic Bounce, but I can at least protect and see what move they lock themselves into. So I'm going to go Seismic Sword early uh, as they lead off at Cinderace. And I'm assuming what they're going to do here is they're going to U-turn out into their Hatterini. So we're going to go for Scald. Uh, every bit of damage on the thing is going to matter in terms of... Because it has good special defense. So every bit of damage, if I get a burn as well, uh, they won't be able to take on the... Yeah, they won't be able to take me on with my with my Toxtricity. Ooh. I guess they could Psychic immediately, huh? You know what's really useless here? Conk Elder. Like, literally. Loses to every single Mon they have. Like, quite actually. Mmm... <laughs> That's not good. Especially because they're leftovers. Alright. I think I max guard here. To stall out turns. This is going to hurt. <laughs> my friend, this is going to hurt. Oh my gosh, it definitely hurt there. It 100% hurt there. I think I go hard Grimstar on their Trick Room. Because they don't have Psychic Terrain up anymore. And I can go for Sucker Punch to knock them out. There we go. Okay. <laughs> that was so scary, man. Yo, Cinderace is a problem now. Uh, I had to max, which is annoying there. Is this a full Trick Room team? Oh, they bulked up in my face. I don't know if that was a play, my man. I'm max attack. And that's Prankster too, so I might just be faster. I was not faster. I was definitely not faster. <laughs> if they bulk up in my face, I might lose. I'm going to click Sold. Yeah, I don't, I don't mind. I, I would probably lose if they bulked up. I think I lose either way because of what they have left and what I have left. <laughs> Yo, Trick Room is legit now. I can't wait to use Hattery. That's sick. Oh, okay. Land. What they expect my Charizard to do? I already Dynamax. Trick Room is scary, especially when I'm using offense. Maybe I'll get one more game. Just to see. Dude, it's eating. I'll look for another game. This one's a wrap. I think I lost. I missed twice too. Good game, dude. That's so sick. That is so sick. All right. I'm loving this because I'm learning as I'm playing. So, note to self, steel type. <laughs> Ooh, same mon as me. I love it. All right. Early rocks are going to be very key considering what my opponent has. Um... Toxtricity versus Toxtricity is very scary in this too. I would go Darm early versus me personally. I'm going to see if I can get up Rocks early because, yeah, again, Darm is just such a good lead. And getting up Rocks for Dragonite, uh, Dragonite, excuse me, for Gyarados is super worth it. My Toxtricity can Overdrive here, which is really nice, especially with Rocks up. 
Come on. Are you serious, bro? Bro. Are you seriously? Seriously. Of course it's me. Yeah, of course you'd say Abe after flitching me into critting me. Yes. Hey, well, come on, man. I can still win this game. Like, so annoying, though. All right. Anyway, my bad. I should have said I'm going to pull a double anticipating. Uh, of course, it'll come out, but he ends up going out to this, so. Gives me a nice volt switch. That is very frustrating. That is very frustrating. We click crash and we get a kill. I'm going to try and flinch his Gyarados to death considering what he just did to me. I think Charizard is the weakest link. It doesn't beat anything. Hmm. I will mock punch here just for the... Mm. Let me drain punch. Okay, come on, come on. All right, good. He gives me Darmanitan. That's amazing. Okay, so I have a chance to win with a bulk up uh, Grimmsnarl, I think. As he goes, Gyarados. I'm going to drain punch again. As he kills me immediately. Does he have Earthquake? I guess if he has Earthquake, I just lose, huh? Come on, buddy. Let's go, Toxtricity. Let's go, buddy. Go ahead and give me that, Garrett. Oh, my gosh. This mod is a problem now. All right, we'll bring out Grimmsnarl here, and I'll click Bulk Up, and I might just win. I may just win. I'll be honest here. I might just win. I'll give it that Corbin Knight. That's fine. Do I Darkest Larry first? I think I Darkest Larry first. Did too much damage. Um. Okay, Darm. I think I literally spam Ice Cream Crash and try and flinch him to death. And I think I deserve this too based on what actually ended up happening. Nope. Toxtricity on Corsola, exactly. Volt switch out. And I think we quote for a crit here. Like what else can I do? That like that's insane, man. Absolutely insane how it started. I can't I couldn't catch a break. Hey. Let's go though. Let's go, Grimmsnarl. Yeah, click your move. Good game. Good game. That's how we do it out here. Frank is a good guy. I've played him a bunch of times, but man, that's that first turn is so annoying because rocks were just so good in this game. Good videos. Hey, thank you. I'm pissed off about your miss it. I played Frank plenty of times, but my gosh, man. Imagine, just imagine rocks in this game. And yes, it's okay to be frustrated even though you win. I'm passionate about this game. But, uh, so the reason I had to like, what is it? Ah, gosh, my legs are stuck. Uh, the reason I had to go, I had to get in, um, Toxtricity here and Bolt Switch is because he definitely would go for Rock. I didn't expect Grimstar to be able to kill Corsola. I'm going to be completely honest. I thought I lost the game. I thought it was going to live and, and then Strength Sap it all back or just Nightshade me to death. But anyway, hope you guys all enjoyed. Of course, if you did, feel free to leave a like and subscribe. Definitely a rough one, but Toxtricity was fun, man. Overdrive and Boom Burst was a ton of fun. I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye, my friends.